Square Enix drafted their development dream team to create their next MMORPG, Final Fantasy XIV. They wanted to create a game different from FF11, and producer Hiromichi Tanaka nurtured their creativity by not meddling. The graphics were gorgeous, but the game was buggy, incomplete, and just really frustrating. Negative beta feedback gave the development team second thoughts, but they had the Final Fantasy name, and FF11 was becoming the most profitable of the series. So in 2010, they released as scheduled, earning such accolades as most disappointing game of the year. FF14 damaged the Final Fantasy brand, prompting Square Enix to formally apologize and replace a large chunk of the development team. New unknown producer Naoki Yoshida and his team worked day and night to find a solution. The original team's programming made starting FF14 over the fastest course. They spent two years completely revamping the graphics engine, combat system, and interface. In August 2013, when the servers became congested, they extended the beta and added new servers. Messing up twice would destroy Square Enix. The company expenses, resources, and delay of other Square where Enix games would all be worth it with the launch of Final Fantasy XIV A Realm Reborn, producing a game worthy of the Final Fantasy name, earning multiple MMO of the Year awards, and making it up to fans. Have fun!